guys welcome to another episode of buzz lady quick one today i'll be showing you three gospel movements you can use going to your two chord progression okay um it can be called league it can be called movement whichever way movement or leagues are ways of expressing yourself on the base there's no special thing about league or movement okay so that's it now i'm going to use this song that i'm just finished playing I'm going to use that song to explain everything, every of the move I played. Okay, so um, of course, you know, first thing you should look out for is the key of the song. And, uh, and another thing I want to bring to your notice is always know this, that um, not every song you come across starts from the one chord progression. Okay, there are some songs that can start from the sixth chord. There are some songs that can start from the two chord, some start from four chord, you know, and things like that. So progression is different from you getting the key. The fact that a song progression started on the two chord does not mean it doesn't have a key. Okay, so the, the key there on the song is my, is my A. Okay, so now the progression on that song started from the six chord. Okay, so the fact that the progression started on the sixth chord does not mean that's the key. Okay. This is the key, A. But the progression started from the sixth chord. Bless you, Lord, you are home. Two, then you go to your four. And four, five, one. Then syncopation in between to the progression again. To your six chord again that's the syncopation there one seven six bless you lord you are two four and forever five one okay thirty la, 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 re. then five Basically, this is just the progression of the song. One, seven, always leading you to your C. Then you go to your two. Then you go to your four. And five and one. Okay, so that's it. The first movement I did, the first lick I played there, leading me into my two chord, was this. <laughs> A chromatic walk down. The sustain note. This thing helps to beautify your move. Instead of you going plain. Okay. 
Okay, so that was the first move to my um, two chord. Okay, my two chord going to my four chord. I can as well do that move. Okay, you can go that way. But I landed on my two because I know after my two, I'm heading to four. So I quickly create something again from the two here. I quickly create something again. Leading me also to my four chord. Don't forget, each of the chord progressions on that song they are connected to each other so that's why the first move i played i'm already on my two chord then i'm going to my four chord so i quickly create something going to my four chord okay then i reach to my four chord then i relax five chord back to my one chord okay so that's how these things work they are all connected to each other so as you're doing one you're also thinking of the next chord progression you're going okay this is my one this is my two this is my three this is my six this is my six this is my five five four four three three two two one okay so the movement started from the six okay Da, C, six. This is my three. Don't forget the key we uh This is, is A, B, and C sharp. Okay. So one, two, three. So C, three, one, seven, six, four, three, flat three, two. Before the next one. One six seven one one six seven one then you drop to four 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 the sixteen note then four 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 three one five four okay so tonics of annotation there will be La me do la fa mi mo re do la ti do fa 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 mi do so fa okay so that's it Now the second movement I played simple also this is it da, da. it's like you're running a Dorian mode going to your two okay this is chromatic down the chromatic movement leading me to my two four three flat three two I substitute the the six with the three. Okay, on a normal day, that's the question. Always go do ti la, right? One seven six. But I substitute the six with the three. So this is what I did, so that I can be able to achieve that movement leading me to my two chord. So I did one seven three da da di three five. Like a passing note from two to three. Two, three, two, three, 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 three. Like this kind of hammer on thing. That was what I did there. Okay, so I substitute the six with the three. One, seven, three, five, three, two, one, seven, six, five. Four, three, flat, three, two. Then four, five, one. So that was it. So tonics of annotation there will be do ti mi so mi re do ti la so fa mi mo re. Then do fa. Then 
saw one okay so the last movement i did on the song was this um similar movement to the first movement i did so that was what i did what happened there is kind of um, um repetition of the notes okay so what i did here is what i came up here to do then i also repeat that same note here again da, da, da. Da, da, da. So your ability to meet up with the timing will enable you to achieve it with ease and it will come out lovely. Okay. So that's it. Um, so let me, let's go again. This is my A. Don't forget the key we are. A. A. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3. 1, 7. 3, 1, 7, 6. 3 flat 3 2 3 flat 3 2 3 flat 3 2 then you take your move to the next chord progression you're going okay so that's it the tonics of a notation will be do ti mi do ti la mi ma re mi ma re mi ma re then do fa so so do these are the three movements i want to show you going to your leading you to your two chord progression on any song you can try it on 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 any song okay so that was it if you're new to this channel do not forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. You can afford to miss new video I upload every week. Hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. Okay, and if you need private lessons again from me, every information is right there on the screen or right there in the description below. Okay, chat me by WhatsApp, send me an email indicating you want to join the private lesson. I will tell you everything you need to go about the registration. Okay, that's all for today. I will see you in my next video. Bye.